15. These are some amazing specimens, and I really appreciate you bringing me by. So it's saying here this is an agate slice, and they are amazingly priced, but I really am curious to have you explain to me how that formed if you would. Sure. So this, this is a geode agate slice, and what you see here, look it up in the window, you can see that. It's, it's gorgeous, all the different colors and so forth. These are generally in an oval shape. They've been sliced off. So this was a air pocket originally in the sediment. And in the sediment, you have um, permeation. They're liquids, okay? And we have is dissolved solids. So silica is the primary constituent. Silica is like quartz, only when it's dissolved, just like salt will dissolve in water. You also have silica under like pressure and temperature will dissolve under water. And when you have an air pocket like this, um, and water, this is where it was concentrated in, and these colors came from the microbes, and, and this area grew sl slower, but the white areas have the crystals. That was more pure silica, and it grew, this grew slower, this grew faster, and that's why you actually see some of the crystals huh. still in there. Awesome. So these are really neat examples showing, you can come down here and see, all the different kinds here. Um, as you hold that one, you think you yes. might want to get that one. But you can see this one here is another one. How just beautiful the different colors are. Okay, so these are rather thin, so the light can shine right through them. But these are quartz crystal agates that have been sliced, or geodes typically will call when they have an opening like this right here. You know, and you see the crystals inside. See those pretty crystals yes. right there? Uh -huh. Yeah, those are those. So this would be typically called a geode. You broke it open to saw these pretty crystals. And by the way, these are found only on the surface of the earth. You don't go down the Grand Canyon and find any layers of geodes. Okay? Nice. They're only found up on the surface because that's when they, how they formed when they formed 4,363 years ago. So these are all over the world, the same as petrified wood. We don't find it down in the different layers, it's only on the surface. You know, all evidence in the U.S. Wonderful, thank you. And look at all these. Tables and tables. Oh, there's blue ones back over there.